In the run up to getting my GCSE results last Thursday, I watched a lot of videos on YouTube of people sharing their results. Whether this made me feel better or just instilled a further sense of dread into my being, I don't really know. I thought that since I watched so many of them, I might as well make my own sort of giving back or creating a carbon neutral cycle or I don't know what I'm talking about. The results day was on the 20th of August, so this does come a bit late. I mean, I was just partying hard to celebrate my results, so what can I say? Anyway, on with the results. I was really, really surprised with these grades because I didn't think that this was possible for me to achieve, especially because I didn't really think many of the exams went that well when I was doing them. But I was so happy when I opened this. So even though I did my GCSEs this year, the first result on my paper is critical thinking, which was actually an AS level paper, for which I got an A. In history, I got an A star. In music, I got an A, which I was like over the moon with because music was just a nightmare. Maths, I got an A star. Biology, I got an A star. Chemistry I got an A star, physics A star, religious studies A star, French A star, German A star, English language A star, English literature A star, and level 2 project A star. So yeah, I'd say that was a pretty good turnout, I'm quite proud of myself. The results I was most surprised about were maths, physics, and German. Not German because I struggled with it, but because I gave up on it in the end. Maths and physics I just didn't think I could get an A star, I just thought, no, I'll settle for whatever grade comes at me as long as I pass. So when I got an A star I was like, what? Something crazy is in the water hole. French, English literature, biology and chemistry I was also really, really glad I got A stars in because I'm doing those next year so hopefully that proves I can do them. Chemistry, not so much. It's supposed to be very difficult. Wish me luck. I hope if you're watching this video that whatever results you've collected or are going to collect that you get the results you wanted to. Also if anyone wants to see any more school related videos or like revision tips then just request it in the comments and I'll do it because I'm a little nerd. On that note as well I have a Tumblr vlog dedicated to like stationery and revision. There's this whole portion of Tumblr called study blur which motivates people to revise and stuff so I started that before I did my exams just to motivate myself into doing it. I'll put a link for that in the description. Anyway that's it for today's video. I'm going on holiday for a week so there won't be any more videos until I get back but I hope everyone's doing well. Goodbye! Well